the internet, the great ether that we all share. Uh, we're doing some <laughs> reactions. This one is, an, is a suggestion. Uh, thanks for the suggestion. This is uh, the Dark Comedy Late Show Open Mic Eagle. I watched, um, or I did one of Mo Open Mic Eagle's videos before. It was fucking awesome. Uh, I, need to, I need to listen to the rest of that album. But uh, in the meantime, let's watch this uh, video. This is called Dark Comedy Late Show. I'm not sure. Uh, there, was a, there were several videos that came up uh, when I searched this. So hopefully this is the one you were intending for me to watch. But if it's not, let me know in the comments, and I'll watch the other one that you wanted me to watch. Uh, yeah, so uh, also anything else anybody wants me to watch, respond to, react to, let me know downstairs in the comments. So let's go right to it. Let's get into it. Here we go. From CDA Studios in Chicago, it's Dark Comedy Late Show with Mike Eagle. Here's your host, Mike Eagle. I, uh, of course, I will be stopping this uh, from time to time so that uh, so as to avoid the YouTube sentinels that are big old pieces of shit. Here we go. We have a fucking incredible show for you tonight. It's part of me saying fucking on network television. I'm not going to have this job for long. It's Exile. It's me. It's you. These are our guests. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> this is already incredible. Um, TV should just be like this because people getting offended about stuff is fucking ridiculous because all words are made up. Here we go. I gave up and became a Spotify. Paying myself a fraction of a penny playing qualifiers. I'm looking up and I'm stuck in it. Oh my. Seems there are, uh, there's commentary on those cards. Let's see if I can freeze that frame to see what that card said because it looked like something about gun violence. So <laughs> let's see what, what Mike has to say. Uh, that he's not reading off the cards, but we're getting anyway. Let's, let's find so a fraction of a penny. <laughs> Yeah, yep, we got a lot of guns, that's true. Um, here we go. Any playing qualifiers, I'm looking up. Damn it. That's a, I, I, it, hopefully I get more of that next card in the, uh, let's find out. Paying myself a fraction of a penny playing qualifiers. Damn it, I, I didn't, it, couldn't see the whole card. But it said, and by race, I didn't see the rest of the card. Let's hopefully, hopefully that card comes up in another shot. I'm looking up and I'm stuck in a chuck movie. Second yucky shit to chuckles like it's lucky movie. So somebody. Ooh, this, okay, this is a dense one. Uh, let's gonna, I'm gonna run it back and see what that card says. I'm also gonna look up the lyrics here if I can, uh, so that I understand what he is uh, talking about in the rest of the video. Let's uh, see if I can freeze frame. Second yucky shit to chuckles like it's lucky. Oh, here we go. A great, a great, what a great looking audience. Don't tell them, but last night's uh, crowd looked like extras from a Fellini movie. That's, <laughs> this guy's making Fellini references over here? Man. Okay, let's, uh, <laughs> uh, Dark Comedy Late Show lyrics. Let's find out. We're just going to, we're just going to take a little pause here and then see what he's talking about here. Oh, man, there's a lot of lyrics. Okay. Yeah, um, I'm not going to read all those lyrics, uh, but man, there's, it looks like this guy's a genius. Here we go. Let's, let's keep going. So somebody better cancel me before I get a chance to screen this ass naked dance routine. It's dark comedy, cold as a soldier stare. I've been exposed, so now the lows is my overwear. And I'm a polar bear with words for a fancy song. I think it's the first verse from Little... <laughs> It's dark comedy, uh, cold as a soldier's stare. Damn, I've been exposed, so now the lols is my overwear. That's awesome. Yeah, comedy, just tragedy with a smile. Here we go. Little miss can't be wrong. <laughs> Fuck you, I like to spin doctors. Is that dude's fan's father or just an imposter? <laughs> Man, spin doctors back to back with, I, I think, an Adventure Time reference? Man. Uh, I think it's the first verse, uh, I'm sorry, and I'm a polar bear with words for a fancy song. I think it's the first verse from Little Miss Can't Be Wrong. Fuck you. I like the spin doctors. Is that dude Finn's father or just an imposter? God damn. 
up the new internet things to be pretend odd with non prescription thick rim frames of rented gym lockers. I'm a rapper, we lament being broke. All the comics getting money, but they spend it on coke. You can watch us on the news feeds, fucking y'all's warnings up until America admits that it likes dogs more than us. Wow. Uh, all the comics get money, but they spend it on coke. You can watch us on the news feeds, fucking y'all mornings up until America admits that it likes dogs more than us. Ooh. And I can see the Super Bowls of the future, the Ferguson Blacks versus Missouri State Troopers, the privacy rights versus the personal computers, concussion researchers versus university boosters. I graduated college, I purchased all the extra books. I'm supposed to be living in a house with a... down and noticed the, the, the light wasn't on because I'm an idiot. Uh, but anyway, he was he was saying, uh, and I can see the Super Bowls of the future, the Ferguson Blacks versus Missouri State Troopers, the privacy rights versus the personal computers, concussion researchers versus university boosters. I graduated college. I purchased all the extra books. I'm supposed to be living in a house with a breakfast nook. Wow. So much real talk. Breakfast nook. Jokes on me though. All this cheap alcohol and no Coke Zero. A shame how proximity kills your heroes. Hey yo, no poking, I'm still woke, see low. Yeah, it's all ripped from the headlines. Ashamed how proximity kills your heroes. Yeah, you don't, uh, oftentimes you don't really want to know all the details about a human, uh, human's life who you admire and that's all right because no one's perfect and if you allow other people's actions to ruin your experience of maybe something they have created that has a different meaning to you than it does to them then that makes you an asshole i'm all out of options like a crip on the red line p.s i'm not saying you should go pay money to go see r kelly live i'm just saying that if uh, I believe I can fly makes you feel good because you have a, a memory connected to it, then you shouldn't let that fucking asshole ruin that for you. Had a deadline before I never had a deal. Stormed out of business meetings, slip on mass banana peels. I should probably shut my stupid mouth shirtless in a fur hat and Vladimir Putin out. And North Korea's got practice missiles. And I still check Yahoo because we both got attachment issues. Our Congress moves just like. Putin, North Korea. Let's, uh, if you haven't checked out Vladimir Putin's house, just type in uh, Putin's palace on YouTube and you'll see why uh, everything in Russia that isn't Moscow uh, is shitty because all the money is, it, is at his house. It's literally at his house. You can go look at it. I could cold could invade Iraq 15 times in my adulthood. And we quit asking for the reasons to click the Constitution's terms of service agreements invade iraq 15 times in my adulthood mm -hmm. yep what are we doing we're dreaming from sundown to hot noon and woke up by you two albums all in your itunes and it's close to an all-out war with kids being murdered just for being black and tall outdoors they respond to demonstrations wearing kevlar briefs when the main problem is nobody respects our grief they say if uh, when the main problem is or, uh, i'm sorry uh, they respond to demonstrations wearing Kevlar briefs. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what's the, yeah. Why whenever people are just, uh, you know, gathering to express their dis displeasure with the state of things, why do we have a bunch of armed people showing up that uh, every single time that happens, something bad happens? Maybe, maybe we shouldn't, maybe we don't need to do that. Anyway. If it bends, it's funny. If it breaks, it ain't, though. I still got broke pockets and trying to host a late show. Recording it every night, but I don't know where the tape go. Homeless fashionistas tell me everything that they know. Yeah, you got a style. Tie them fancy sandals up, smile. You're on the NSA's candid cannabis now. I'm in a church basement learning Shotokan. Saw Jesus taking a selfie in our photo bomb.
<laughs> I'm in a church basement learning Shotokan. That's karate. Uh, I saw Jesus taking a selfie and I photo bombed. Man, this is this is fantastic. It do better tag me. A little recognition makes me do better gladly. Like this one time when I got booed at a track meet in the Hellfire Club sweater for two letter athletes. One for <laughs> Oh, he's great too. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, if if you photobomb Jesus, he should probably tag you. Um, also, if you're talking about a bunch of reasonable shit, uh, maybe you should tag you that for that as well. Not that he. Uh, anyway, here we go. Regret dreams, one for most suppressed team. Pressure valve gets released and sprays like a jet stream. Carl Kanaz and Z Capuigi's from Chess King. K Mart name brands were the least interesting. I appreciated presidential speeches on the West Wing. I never had wet dreams of piloted an X Wing. I'm still. X Wing. Mmm. Open mic eagle, you're a hero. Terrible at being sarcastic, black. My man exile, he knows what I'm laughing at. My man toy light, he knows what I'm laughing at. The studio audience knows what I'm laughing at. I'm just gonna go back real fast on some of the lyrics earlier. We have, oh man. Uh, let's see here. Uh, like this one time, a little recognition makes me do better gladly. Like this one time when I got booed at a track meet in a Hellfire Club sweater for two letter athletes. <laughs> yeah, wow. Laughing at all types of shit. I laugh at uh, CNN. I don't know why. It might be an issue. There might be a problem actually. It's not, it's not a humorous channel, you know what I mean? It's not trying to compete with Comedy Central. If anything, it's trying to compete with Headline News, which I'm pretty sure is like the same company. Or it's trying to compete with uh, MSNBC, kind of. But MSNBC is blue and to the left. The CNN is red, white, and black, and in the middle. And Fox... I'll read all this. He's, he's saying uh, that the... I laugh at CNN, I don't know why. That might be an issue. That might be a problem, actually. It's not. It's not a humorous channel, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm not trying to... Com it's, not, it's not trying to compete with Comedy Central. If anything, it's trying to compete with Headline News, which I'm pretty sure is the same company, or it's trying to compete with N MSNBC, kinda. NBC, MSNBC is blue and to the left. CNN is red, white, and black, and in the middle. And Fox News is bright red and hollering and on the right. And there's an elephant and a donkey, and then an Ella donkey fan and a donka fan, uh, hella donka fan. <laughs> He's right. What the fuck is all that? Uh, if you you know if you if you're inside all the time watching the news, it seems like there's a, it's it's fucking total chaos outside. But if you just walk around for a little while, you realize it's just the same out there. It's shitty and not shitty all at once um, but yeah the news will have you believe that it's just raining down uh well whatever you're afraid of uh, depending on what channel you're watching it's raining that down on you outside every time you go out there uh, if you just watch the tv here we go it's bright red and hollering and on the right and there's an elephant and a donkey and then an ella donkey fence a donkey fence uh a hella donkey fence Shit. Get get this guy on here. He's he's way less scary than the last guy. He's got uh yeah, he's he's this is a much more palatable host than what we were just dealing with here. Every, every, everyone in the audience is going crazy. Well, that was certainly a special treat. Thank you for so much for that suggestion. I'm going to have to watch that several more times because I was barely even getting to watch the video because there was so much stuff going on with the fucking lyrics. Uh, I'm sure there was a lot of stuff I missed in the video. If I missed anything, let me know in the comments uh, visually that was funny because I'm sure there's a lot of funny shit 
during the video. I couldn't even look at the cue cards anymore because there was so much happening with the lyrics. Anyway, man, that was great. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking it out to the end of the video. Uh, make sure to do all the, um, you know, all the YouTube stuff. Uh, let's shoot for more subscribers. Let, why don't we shoot for, uh, I don't know, let's shoot for, shoot for a thousand. We're, we're like 10% of that right now. So let's tell, tell all your friends, tell your friends, share these videos. And uh, yeah, so I'll see you next time. Be safe wherever you happen to be. And remember, if someone asks you if you're a god, you say yes. Thank you. And good evening.